will pay up or fight the fine. That is the decision facing the Gilbert School Board tonight. An audit recently found the district owes the state nearly $1 million. CBS 5's Donna Rossi is here in studio with what's at the very heart of this issue tonight. Donna? Well, seeing Gilbert Public Schools got hit with the bill after auditors found the, dist the di district miscalculated student enrollment and attendance figures for years. The bill comes just one month after Gilbert Public Schools Superintendent Christina Kishimoto was picked for the top education job in the state of Hawaii. Arizona auditors found that Gilbert Unified overcounted their enrollment figures by 512 high school students over a three-year period and misreported attendance data for more than 1,300 online students. Schools get state monies based on enrollment and attendance. Because of that, auditors say the district overcharged the state nearly a million dollars, and the state wants that money back. Former school board member Julie Smith says the district was already facing budget cuts, and this will only make things worse. It absolutely will have a compounding hurtful blow that I do believe will be reflected in the classroom. And this district will be, I believe, in the next year forced because of budget cuts due to student loss and then this million dollars to close schools to consolidate. The district could vote tonight to appeal the bill. The board is set to meet behind closed doors at 6. Then the issue is on the agenda for the open special meeting set to get underway at 6.30. We do have a crew that will be there who will let you know what the board decides. All right.